This video is an excerpt from a recent members only video analyzing a Spencer Lee match. You can access the full video and additional exclusive content by supporting the channel through YouTube memberships or Patreon. And this is a great camera angle to really see this head lever in action. So we've seen this a lot, but this is probably the best quality angle we've seen. So wrist control with the left hand, you can see Lee's head behind the opponent's upper arm. So it's kind of, it's, it's just a little bit above the elbow here in this case. And he's going to use the crown of his head in particular. Drives forward, you can see how that arm bends, the opponent's arm's gonna, left arm's gonna bend behind, and right away, Lee's weaving through. So as soon as that arm is behind, he's gonna let go of the wrist, and he weaves, starting with the hand, the forearm all the way through that gap. And you can see the opponent trying to lock his hands to prevent that that left hand from going behind his back again. So this is a gr really good angle. You can really see this bar here. So watch how Lee jumps his feet to the left. So this is an indication that he's gonna try to run the bar. So he's gonna try to bring the opponent over his right shoulder. And look how the opponent reacts. So this is, this is a high level reaction. Intelligent response is going to turn to his right. So Lee would rather the opponent be looking to the left, but in this case, the opponent knows that he's going to look to his right and he's going to go with it. So he's going to circle with Lee and look at how he's even posting out on his right leg here, making it very difficult for Lee to turn him. So this is a, uh, Obviously not ideal to end up in this bar position, but if you're gonna end up there, this is one way to, to, to prevent yourself from getting turned. You're gonna look away from the bar, you're gonna circle with, and then you can even use that right leg as a post in this case to prevent it.